welcome to Las Vegas, Nevada, Sin City, and my hometown. On this episode of Swinger Says, we're going to count down the top 10 most popular games played by you, the millions who visit my city every single year. Now, if you're asking how we came up with these numbers, we talked to five casino directors at five of the biggest casinos here in Las Vegas. We then spoke to 20 random people at those five casinos. We kept on coming up with the same 10 games, and we feel pretty confident that this top 10 is accurate. So, as we stand outside the Palazzo here on the Strip in Las Vegas, we start our countdown with number 10, Kino. Kino is one of Las Vegas' original games. It's been around since the very beginning. And whether you're playing video Kino or live Kino, the rules are the same. You pick your numbers and then watch for the balls to bounce. And if you're just looking for some cheap drinks, then the Kino Lounge is the place to be. Made famous pretty much by James Bond and all those James Bond films is a game that I will never understand. Number nine, most popular game in Vegas, Baccarat. To play Baccarat, you gotta know the rules of Baccarat. So here they are, the very simple and easy to understand rules of Baccarat. The hand with a point total closest to nine wins. Points are tallied as follows. All cards numbered one through nine are counted at face value. Tens, cards totaling 10, and face cards count as zero. Aces count as one. If the cards total a two-digit number, only the last digit counts. For example, five plus eight equals 13, so 13 counts as three. Winning player and banker bets are paid even money, one to one. Winning banker bets are charged a 5% commission or vigorous. Winning tie bets are paid eight to one. The third card rules dictate the play of the game. The guest's only decision to make is which hand to wager on, player or banker, and if the bet is high enough. Here are the third card rules for the player hand. When the first two cards total 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, or 5, the player draws the third card. When the first two cards total 6 or 7, the player stands. When the first two cards total 8 or 9, the player stands on the natural. If the player takes no third card, the banker hand must stand on all totals of 6 or greater. Number eight on our list of most popular games here to play in Las Vegas, another game that makes no sense to me, Pi Gal Poker. The history of Pi Gal Poker dates all the way back to the 16th century and the Sung Dynasty. But it was brought to America in the early 80s and was first played at the Commerce Casino. The game is actually quite simple. You dealt seven cards. From those seven cards, you must form two hands, the high hand and the low hand. The two best cards are the high hand. The five remaining cards are your low hand. If your high hand and low hand beat the dealer's high hand and low hand, you win the money. Number seven on our list of most popular games here in Las Vegas is a great game if you got 30 bucks. It's called Let It Ride. Let It Ride is a variation of five card poker. The object is simple. You're trying to create the best poker hand possible. The betting is unique. You have the first, second, and ante. The ante is the only money truly at risk. You dealt three cards, and then two community cards are dealt in the middle. You look at your first three cards. If you don't like what you see, you pull back your first bet. Then the first community card is turned over. If you don't like that, you pull back your second bet. The final community card is turned over, and that's the hand. Now, if you look at your first three cards and you like what you see, you do what the game says, and you let all the money ride. Video poke used to be a lot more popular, but it's kind of fallen off in the last few years, but still makes our list. At number six, video poker. With the advent of faster, smaller computers in the early 80s, it became economically viable for casinos to combine a television-like monitor with a fast central processing unit. Video poker was born. The earliest video poker machines would look archaic to today's standards. Throughout the 80s, video poker became more and more popular as new gamblers found the machines less intimidating than sitting down and playing at a live table game. Also, the machines offer you a multiple choice of games. Jacks are better, deuces wild, joker poker, double double. And let's be honest, it doesn't take a rocket scientist to play video poker, but it's fun. Five years ago, this next game probably would have been near the top 
one or two for sure. But in the last few years, it's had a massive drop off, but it still manages to make our top 10. At number five, most popular games in Las Vegas, Texas Hold'em Poker. Little is known about the invention of Texas Hold'em, but most historians recognize that it was created in Robstown, Texas in the early 1900s. It was brought to Las Vegas in 1967 by three Texas gamblers, Crandall Addington, Doyle Brunson, and Amarillo Slim. But it wasn't until 2003 that Texas Hold'em really took off. Two things happened at the same time. Since 1983, ESPN had been showing the World Series of Poker, basically to add content to their 24-hour sports channel. But in 2003, ESPN invented the lipstick camera. This allowed viewers at home to see all the players' hole cards. Then, a total unknown by the name of Chris Moneymaker won the World Series of Poker. Now the game is played by everyone. Movie stars, musicians, actors, lawyers, doctors, CPAs, and even stand-up comedians. Texas Hold'em. I could go through the rules, but I'm not gonna bother. Just sit down at a poker table and shuffle up and deal. The only game in Vegas where the house does not have a clear advantage comes in at number four on our countdown. That's roulette. Roulette comes from the French word meaning little wheel. You place your bet, the dealer spins the wheel, drops the white ball, the ball bounces, whatever number it lands on is the winner. Here's where roulette gets interesting. There are many different combinations of bets. You can bet single numbers, two numbers, four numbers, six numbers, 18 numbers, odds, evens, the first third, the second third, the third third, red, black, or zero or double zero. It's how you bet that determines how much you win. Roulette is a game based on luck and chance. And anyone who says they have a system for winning at roulette is lying. I was once told the only way to learn how to play this next game is if you had a lot of money. I still don't know how to play it. Number three, craps. The game of craps has a long and colorful history, but the origins of the game are not as certain. Some say the game dates all the way back to the time of the Crusades. Others say it was played by soldiers in the Holy Roman Empire. And there are accounts the game was played by Arabs in the Middle East. But the one thing that is known is that in the 1700s, the French brought the game of craps to Louisiana. Now I could probably take a half hour trying to explain the rules of craps and all the different betting options. But why bother? Just do what I do and place your bets like your James Bond. He never loses. I'll take the full odds on the 10, 200 on the hard way. The limit on all the numbers, 250 on the 11. Thank you very much. It probably won't surprise you what the number one and number two most popular games in Las Vegas are, but it might surprise you their order. The number two most popular game in Las Vegas, Blackjack. Hit me! The game we all know as Blackjack wasn't actually called Blackjack when it first came over to the United States. The game's official title was 21. But to entice gamblers to play this new game, casinos offered up an amazing 10 to 1 payout for any player who managed to pair up the ace of spades with either the jack of clubs or the jack of spades. The casinos called this hand Blackjack. And even though casinos no longer offer that 10 to 1 payout, the name Blackjack stuck. Blackjack is without a doubt the most popular table game in all of Las Vegas. And even though casinos always tried to add a little flair or uniqueness to it, the object of the game has never changed. Get closest to 21 without going over and hope the dealer either busts or hope that the dealer's cards add up to a number less than yours. Everybody has played blackjack. Now get some money and go play right now. I said right now. Well, here we are finally at number one, the most popular game in all of Vegas. 
And why is it the number one most popular game in all of Vegas? Because men, women, young, old, black, white, rich, poor, everybody plays this game at one time or another in Vegas. It makes the casinos more money than all the other table games combined. The number one game in Vegas, the penny slots. Oh yeah, let's play. See you next time.